What's up, everybody? Welcome to the September 12th edition of DraftKings Tournament Plays presented by Prize Picks. I'm your host, Adam Scherer. You can follow me on Twitter at ShipMyMoneyDFS. And as a reminder, be sure to click the link below to claim up to a $100 first match deposit bonus on Prize Picks when you sign up and make a deposit. We have a seven game MLB slate tonight. As usual, we're going to take a look at three of the top tournament stacks and three of the top tournament pitchers using the top stacks tool and the top pitchers tool on the stochastic.com website. Starting with the top stacks, number three, the Toronto Blue Jays are taking on Cooper Criswell tonight. He, at AAA this year, has struck out 20.8% of hitters with a 3.96 XFIP. He's likely to go three or four innings for Tampa Bay. The Blue Jays' active roster has a 110 WRC plus and 164 ISO. They're projected for 8% ownership with about a 9% chance of being the top scoring stack. Number two, the New York Mets taking on Javier Assad tonight. He has put together a solid year at AAA, but so far those numbers really haven't carried over to the majors. Only a 16% strikeout percentage since joining the Cubs, 4.64 XFIP. At AAA, he struck out 24.8% of hitters with a 4.11 XFIP. The Mets active roster has a 116 WRC plus and 166 ISO. They're projected for about 7% ownership with an 11% chance of being the top scoring stack. And number one, the Los Angeles Dodgers taking on Ryan Nelson tonight. Nelson really struggled at AAA, but uh, that probably has to do in large part with pitching uh, in the PCL at altitude in really difficult parks for pitchers. He only struck out 21.6% of hitters with a 5.54 XFIP. He is likely better than that, but it is still a really tough matchup for him going against the Dodgers, who have a 120 WRC plus and 191 ISO on their active roster. They are projected for about 11% ownership with a 17% chance of being the top scoring stack. Now, before we take a look at the top three tournament pitchers, we do have a new promo code for viewers of these videos. That promo is Adam MLB. Use it. Get 50% off Stochastic Plus Weekly. This offer is available for new users only. But if you haven't already signed up for Stochastic Plus, take advantage. You'll get access to behind the paywall data, including the top stacks tool and the top pitchers tool that I reference in these videos. So again, that's promo code Adam MLB. Use it and get 50% off Stochastic Plus Weekly. Now taking a look at the top three tournament pitchers. Number three, from Valdez, $10,700 price tag. Or sorry, number three is Tyler Anderson, $8,300 price tag, taking on the Arizona Diamondbacks tonight in Arizona. This is a relatively difficult strikeout matchup as the Diamondbacks active roster has struck out just 20.6% of the time with a 99 WRC+. plus. But Anderson's only projected for 9% ownership with about a 15% chance of being a top two scoring pitcher. Number two. Alex Cobb taking on the Atlanta Braves in San Francisco. We know that there's a lot of power in the Braves lineup. There's also a lot of strikeouts as their active roster uh, has a 112 WRC plus, but also a 24.6% strikeout percentage. Cobb has been very good this year. 24.4% strikeout percentage with a 2.92 XFIP. He's only $8,000 projected for about 20% ownership with a 22% chance of being the top scoring pitcher or a top two scoring pitcher and a 23% chance of being a top two value pitcher. And number one, from Valdez, $10,700, taking on the Detroit Tigers. The Tigers active roster has just an 81 WRC plus and 24% strikeout percentage. Valdez is elite at keeping the ball on the ground. He has middle-of-the-road strikeout stuff, striking out about 23.1% of hitters this year with a 3.13 XFIP. He's projected for about 28% ownership with a 28% chance of being a top-two scoring pitcher. So to recap, the top three tournament stacks, number three, the Toronto Blue Jays, number two, the New York Mets, Number one, the Los Angeles Dodgers. And the top three tournament pitchers, number three, Tyler Anderson. Number two, Alex Cobb. And number one, Framber Valdez.